Hello everyone, today we will find out what happens when you combine two active alkali metals. For this, I took a piece of sodium and potassium and began to rub them against each other within the evaporating dish. To prevent the alloy from oxidation by being exposed to air, I've decided to conduct the melting of sodium and potassium under a layer of kerosene. Since potassium is a very soft metal, it immediately deforms and wrinkles. Over time, a liquid alloy of sodium and potassium is formed as the point of contact of the two metals, which is instantly being covered by grey oxide film. This alloy remains in liquid state from minus 20 to plus 785 degrees Celsius. It's a very dangerous alloy, because it's more active than sodium or potassium in the round. I'm filling the syringe with a little bit of alloy. Alloy has a glossy surface inside the syringe, switch as mercury. Now I'm dripping sodium potassium alloy into the water. As can be seen, alloy instantly ignites in water, forming burning droplets. If you drop this alloy on the wet surface, the alloy will also light up, sometimes with an explosion. In the end, I pour in the remaining alloy into the water. Wow. Sodium potassium alloy is used in nuclear reactors as coolant, as well in metallurgy. Subscribe to my channel to see many more new and interesting experiments.